I got the stomach bug. I got the stomach bug. It happens a lot of times when you're in these countries away from home. I don't know where I caught it. I'm drinking bottled water. The thing that stinks about it is that the whole team is off to El Arado. I'm here alone in the hotel, letting nature take its course, hopefully sooner than later. Tomorrow's the last full day that we'll be able to do some work there, and I haven't had anything to eat. Yesterday I had breakfast. It was around lunchtime. I ate half my sandwich. That's as much as I could take. Ended up sitting around quite a bit during the vlog to this restaurant. They laid out this really large platter, three of them, with two different kinds of sausage links just all over it, a steak, pork chops, and some of it was a little bit more spicy. They had baked potatoes, guacamole, and there was three large ones like that, and, and everybody just feasted on it. I've been looking forward to that meal all week, and the only thing I had was a piece of garlic bread along with a bottle of 7-Up. I drank half of it, and the reason why, you know, it's been like eight years since I've had a soft drink until yesterday. I drank half a 7-Up just to kind of help with my upset stomach. Man, it was a shock to the system, like a bunch of needles hitting the tongue. <laughs> getting kind of bored wanted to show you my view from my window here looking down into a little courtyard where we eat breakfast and meals it's real nice you can see there's a place up there at the top where you can go eat it's just right over our heads in the room and uh this is kind of where i'm in hanging editing video reading a little bit from this book two very boring minutes later everything in me wanted to think I was starting to feel better. But then I get up and walk around a little bit and I start feeling a little sick to my stomach. I don't know if it's just because I haven't eaten in a long time or if it's something else, but oh my goodness. And then, and then I start having a little itch and I've got a mosquito bite and that's just perfect, you know, Zika virus. <laughs> You never know what you're going to get. Anyways, but I didn't expect to get the mosquito bite right here in my hotel room. So I didn't have any bug spray on. <sighs> oh well. Later in the void. All right, it's been half the day. I still haven't been able to eat food. I don't speak Spanish, but I'm going to go downstairs and see if the hotel's restaurant is um, not only open, but they can give me a menu and I can just point at something because my stomach's starting to get achy at this point and I think just my, mainly out of hunger oh my goodness I, I just hope I hope they have something I can get right now praise God I was downstairs trying to talk to the guy to figure out if they had food and they only serve breakfast here so no food and then he started trying to help me look up a menu to get food that I could eat here in town delivered to me and we couldn't figure out what to do while we were looking up stuff the group pulled up in the van to go to dinner. They hadn't eaten dinner yet, so I'm going to get to go with them right now. I'm so excited. Anna's here waiting to go to the bathroom. Oh, uh, yes. oh my goodness. Oh, yes. I can't tell you how thankful I am. My belly hurts so bad. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Everything we passed smells so stinking good right now. It's raining, but at least we're getting food. All right, so we made it to the Crazy Monkey. Ah! That was the name of the restaurant. Ah! As hungry as I was, I couldn't eat much. I, I'm able to drink some punch and about maybe eat about six chips from my nachos that I ordered. And that's about all I could do because I kept feeling like I was going to either throw up or it just made my stomach feel very uneasy. And so anyways, but that's better than nothing because now that it's not so cramped up, uh, even though I just feel weak. Uh, we're back at the hotel. The group is downstairs meeting together. I'm gonna get back in bed and hopefully I'll feel better to start off the day in the morning. Right now, Pepto-Bismol is gonna be my friend. So uh, thank you for bearing through this vlog as I have just not been able to do much 
and I sure would appreciate it if you would give this video a thumbs up and that you would feel free to comment and please subscribe to this channel uh, for more of that good life. Peace out.